Hey everyone, I am Mr. Alper. Today I am going to show you how to fix scratch disk full error in Adobe Photoshop. The step that I am about to show you will going to work in any Adobe Photoshop. Whether you are using Adobe Photoshop CC 2017, Adobe Photoshop CC 2015, Adobe Photoshop CS6, Adobe Photoshop CS5 or earlier version of Adobe Photoshop. show you so as you can see could not complete your request because whenever you do something in Photoshop editing mixing your image etc etc Photoshop make a temp save file for you for a backup if you by mistake done something wrong and wants to go back that's why Photoshop make a temp file in your scratch disk let me show you which is my scratch disk to see which is your scratch disk you have to go to preferences and scratch disk if it, it's not there then go to general and select each and every one one by one but in my case my scratch disk option is right here so my scratch disk is C drive and as you can see free space is only 376 MB. My C drive is almost no, not almost exactly 50.4 GB and free space is only 376 MB. So we have to clear this. So, what we are going to do first, clear all files from temp folder, second, clear all files from recycle bin, third, clear all files from temp folder, and fourth. Clear all Adobe temp files. To do it, let me show you one more thing. So to do it, press Windows key plus R button, or you can go to Start and type R U N and open this Run and type T E M P temp and press Enter or click on OK. Now. These are the files that we didn't need anymore. These are the temp files. We can delete it. Make sure you close all the application rather than Photoshop. Okay, you can close Photoshop also, but it's all up to you. Okay, now clear all the temp files. Press Ctrl plus A and press Shift plus Delete to permanent delete this this file. Click Yes. Some file will be not going to be deleted. All of them has been deleted. Close this. Now, as you can see at the moment when I started making this video, uh, my C drive C space was something 300, but now it become 400. Now, open your recycle bin and right click and click on empty recycle bin. Click yes. Close it. Now clear all files from temp folder but this time we will going to clear something more advanced so press windows key plus r button to open this run and type percentage sign then temp again percentage sign click on ok now now press ctrl plus all and press shift plus delete to delete all these files click on yes as I was explaining before, some file will be not be deleted like this one. So we have to close Photoshop first. Close the Photoshop and then try again. So okay, now you can cancel. So as you can see, my free space changed. Now it becomes 2.18 GB free space. But if you want to open your Photoshop file, you can now. Let me show you that you can. As you can see, it's rating temp, Photoshop temp, etc. etc. Okay, we need more space to open this file. Okay, no problem. So, this is the last step and it will going to work. Open your internet browser, whichever you like to. I am using Opera. You can use Mozilla Firefox, Google Chrome, uh, Internet Explorer whichever you like to okay now go to google.com bing.com ask.com whichever search engine website you like to use you can 
in my case i am using google.com in search box type win tir so just open this w i n d i r s t a t you have to download this software this software will help you to clear more files you may know this software or hear this software before maybe not or maybe so download it so list of official download mirrors okay i am going to download it from from this website this software is totally free you don't have to pay anything So here it is the software. Software is downloaded successfully. Now double click. So we have to install this software before we can use it. So at the moment we required to clear only C drive. So select C drive only, individual drives, and click on OK. It will going to scan your C drive. It will going to show you which folder is taking how much space, etc., etc. It will take some time. It's all depend on your computer and your hard disk speed. So I am going to fast forward this. So as you can see, my C drive scanned successfully, but before. I clear from C drive. I have to close Photoshop and open again percentage sign and click on OK and select all and shift plus delete and clear OK. So my space again become two point one six. Now close this. So as you can see, my user folder taken 17.8 GB, Windows folder taken 17.0 GB files. So let's open this folder. We can't delete this Windows system title. No, we can't delete anything from this folder. We have to delete files from user. Go to user, your username. As you can see in username folder i have 17.6 gb files i have to open this app data folder having 16.5 gb open it roaming folder having 13.13 gb space i mean taken 13 gb space open adobe so here it is adobe is taking 12.6 gb space so we have to clear the temp file okay open let me minimize maximize this So now common open common and here it is media cache files peak files essential graphics media and core etc etc these are the temp files so we have to clear all of this okay and if I clear this uh, everything from this common folder it will going to fix that scratch disk full error right click select copy path or open here whatever you like to and we have to delete these folders but wait things to be noted in some case your settings of photoshop might be deleted so you have to take care about it because i hadn't have any preset in my adobe photoshop so i am free to delete these files but if you have some preset in adobe photoshop then you have to search more about this Okay, you have to search more preset etc. You have to save those files because you have the preset. You have if you want to save preset, then you have to search more about the inside this folder. But if you don't need preset, then you can delete all of this, like I am about to do. Right click, press shift, delete, and it will permanently delete these files click yes and my C drive is empty 
14.6 GB is been empty. Now I can freely use my Photoshop. Let me show you. So as you can see, my PhD file is opened successfully. I hope your file also open like this. So that way you can clear your scratch disk full error in Adobe Photoshop. So I hope you find this video informative. Click on like button if you find this video informative. Comment below if you having any questions regarding this video. I will try my best to help you. If you subscribe my channel then you can message me on Mr. Helper Facebook fan page. Link is in description box below if you need any help. Share this video link to your friends, to your family member, whoever you like to share. It's totally free. At last, make sure to subscribe my channel for more videos like this. So until then, take care, have a nice day and I will see you next time. Bye.